We're here with well-known Long Island author Carrie Ann Flanagan Brosky, who's going to talk to us about the inspiration behind her debut novel, The Metal. Uh, first of all, tell me about the inspiration behind the book. What made you want to write it? What inspired me to write this book was that my father had multiple sclerosis for 16 long years and it was a very difficult period of time for me. I had lost my faith and you know watching someone you love die is, is never easy. So what I did with this novel is I took the character of Bethany and I created a character that was based of what I witnessed and what I felt uh, during my father's illness and what I watched my mother go through and I created the character based on that. So as far as the aspect of the metal, that's also based on some true stories. Um, at that time I was just so distraught and because there was nothing I could do I felt so helpless and a stranger came into my life just like in Bethany's and gave me a Padre Pio medal and I had never heard of him before and he started telling me about Padre Pio, how he performed miracles, how he bore the five wounds of Christ and from there I started doing my own research on him and learning about him and I really uh, put a lot into that medal and it really helped me to get through those difficult times during my father's illness and so there's that common thread throughout the book of what you know I had gone through and what the character had gone through um, you know the miracles that took place at the end. And um, tell me about, you know, what do you hope that your readers will take away from the book? What I really want people to take away from this book is to have faith and to still believe, as difficult as that may be, and I know I've been there. Um, it's very hard for care people who are caretakers, and uh, everyone's always concerned about the person who has the illness, of course, but the people that are caretakers are, are alone often, and they're in a world that most people don't understand. So I want people to take that away from this book, to sort of give them encouragement that they're not alone, that there are others there out there like them that are taking care of loved ones and that it that it is challenging and that if you have faith and try to believe um, that it will help you get through that that particular journey the other thing as far as the the miracles that take place that sometimes we we pray and we wish for certain things to happen and they don't always turn out the way we want them to but that miracles can in other ways that we're not too familiar with they can still they can still become you know take place and become a miracle in our lives. Thanks, Harry Ann. Thank you, Chris. For more information about the book, you can check out the website, padrepeomedal.com. In Northport, Chris Colora reporting, Long Island Online News.